off we, we actually started doing this so now what I'm going to probably try to end up doing is going to start end up doing this piece right here I think and go into here just like this and just go into here and Just go extrude like this. Right click move. And. Just gonna go into here, bridge, move. Right click.
12 right there. just take this and go bridge right here move like that and now I'm just gonna select this I think right here here and Go into more depths and details and really making this turn out good, I would say. So I'm just going to go into here. And add extract along like that. Let's try that out like that. And maybe what we can do too is kind of add something like this. I fill it like that to just just to give it some layers like that. We'll start off like that. So like that. And Extract around. Like that, I would say. Just extract that around right here. And just go into here and extract along right here. Just go and extract along right here. Just go into here like that.
I'm going to go into here and select the item and just go into here and select link like this. And just go into here and select link like this. Let's try that out. Smooth is perfectly fine. The only thing I want to add in here is going in here. Subdivide. So that's, that's, that's the body frame of the car right there is ready to be used, I would say. The only thing what we would probably would need to do with this, I would say, is go into here. And just go into here and go into here and like that. This, like that. I mean, I guess it already adds like kind of four poly in there. But you would probably would have to move this and probably go into here and go dissolve like that. And then it's not really noticeable. But yeah, it, this is what, what, what it looks like so far. The only thing I'm going to do, honestly, is go into here. Kind of move that down like this. Just go into here and just think this with that like that. And that's it pretty much. Could probably make something like this.
So you want to basically straight that out and that then you would have this ledge ready to be used right there. And then you have kind of a slight curve in here in a way. Very easy. You would go into here and you would try to go into here and go move along right here and that could actually increase the bending of this thing I think somehow in a way and just go into here and that's ready to be used so that's i guess it with the tutorial i mean this is like part three of the tutorial itself and this is like what we got so far so if i were to go into reveal i think vertices right here under view and go reveal this is what we got so far of the car itself so on the next tutorial I might actually end up working on, honestly, is I'm going to start working on the actual um, bumper on this thing and start actually working, getting started on the bumper, I think. Actually, I might actually smooth that out like that. So it's nice and smoothed out like that. And that's what it actually looks like so far on a car. So we would go into here and we would select that one vertice like that, which we would hold down CTR, click and select a vertice like that, like that, and that's like a shortcut key, or you can click on, let's say, move, select that vertice right there, and just go into view and go send basically working box selection like that. We'd make sure that this is showing right here. And we would have that this main box selected. We would go into here. And we would go duplicate and we would try to go flip like that. Actually, let me try to go. We want to select this box right here. So we would go flip like this, like that. And that's the car ready to be used on Carrara. This is basically one, one, one car, one of the cars already done. So now, now, now the next step, what we're going to do is on the next tutorial for, on part four of the tutorial, I think, part four, we're going to start working on the bumper on the car itself. So let me try to go into here and do a series of different renders. So I'm just going to render that out. So I'm saving that as part one.
So I want to make sure we have that. So that's just a render tutorial, I think. And do another render like this. So I want to try to get the right rendering right here. Render. And this is a render of the character itself, and that's how the character is done right here. And we're just going to actually go into here, and we're going to try to save this, and we're going to try to save this as render part, I think, 2 right here, and save that right there. Excellent. Save that as render part two right there. Excellent right there. And that's what we would save right there, I think. I think. And you're right, we would definitely go out of that, I would say. And I guess that, that that's it with the tutorial, I guess. So that's what it looks like when it's fully completed. Like that. It's almost ready. The only thing with that we need to do on the next tutorial, which is part, I think, which is part three of the tutorial, is we're going to start working on a bumper and getting the bumper done. And then right after that, we're going to start working on getting the lower part of the side skirt done, the doors, I think, and start getting the top hood and all that done, I think. Right, I think right back up to here, I think, we're going to start working on getting done on the frame itself and getting the entire frame of the car done on this thing, I think. Like the side skirts, I'm going to start working on the hood, this piece right here, and mainly that piece. And... On the next tutorial is after that is going to be working on the doors. I think getting the trunk done, the bottom bumper done, I think. And then pretty much that's, I think that the first chapter is getting the shell of the car out of the way. I think. And then after that, we're, we go on to chapter two, which is working on small details like the lights. The hood, all that, and all that necessary stuff. And then chapter three is more the wheels and getting the gear system out of the way and the windshield wipers. And then the, the very last one we'll do is on, like, and I guess that's it basically with the tutorial, I guess. And I guess that's it. Stay tuned for part, I think part, I think, four of this tutorial, I think, of chapter one, I think. Please subscribe and give me likes and please subscribe and watch my videos. I hope I can help you out a lot and thank you. Goodbye. Stay tuned for part four.